Bonjour, Bonjour Philippines. Today we are in Boracay working from the beach and we met two amazing content Guys, creators. John, come Bonjour. here. Ta -da! Ta -da! The amazing Bonjour. content creators. Amazing, amazing. <laughs> Ben and Marvin, they have millions of followers. <laughs> Guys, can you tell us about where you have those millions of followers? <laughs> because, because I need you to speak right now. Okay. Uh, we, basically, I basically do TikTok yeah. most of the time. Yeah, they and do TikTok. I do YouTube and TikTok as well. How are you wow. guys? Do you do TikTok? No. 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 Actually, Why? John ate TikTok. Yeah, the problem, I don't like TikTok. Sorry, yeah. guys. Why? How Why? come? We love TikTok. It's giving us money. <laughs> <laughs> We don't have a choice, we're gonna relax. Workation, workation. Come on! So today we will ask them many questions. What's their life as a content creator? Why do they love TikTok? What also are their struggles? How much money they make on the platform? So stay with us and check this out. I think it was the skit contest because I used to do like classroom skit type of videos. Classroom skit where okay. I try to like reenact okay. like the memories that I had in high school and when I was studying. So basically, it's more relatable to my audience. To people that to are people. in school in the Philippine yeah. school, okay. We Not just the students, okay. but also even the older ones because they've been there. Okay. Like they become students also. So I try to be consistent with that kind of content. So that's everything I do before. Okay. So I don't do other type of content except for classroom content. So I just focus on that until I was able to to gain basically followers. And then after, right now I'm trying to like diversify my content. So I'm trying to do lifestyle and trying to do travel. I'm also trying, I'm also trying to do skit as well. But it's more diversified now because I'm trying to like explore more. Wow, and yeah. that's it for this video. Yes. Thank you so much. <laughs> See you tomorrow. Thank you so much. <laughs> I don't have airtime anymore. Yes, <laughs> and my English is no more. <laughs> no, no, it's, it's perfect. perfect. It's perfect. <laughs> to be honest, it's more about sharing my experiences to other people. Um, I'm not saying that I'm a huge, like, influential guy, but like. Every one of us, we all we all have our own experiences, and through our experiences, like even one or two or a lot of people would be able to relate to that. So I I, I wanna like highlight experiences itself. So highlighting experiences, sharing with people, right? Yeah. If I uh, understand correctly, okay. Yeah. And you, what, what's the thing that made you love content creation? Um. Actually, this is the thing that I really wanted to pursue, even even before. So right now, I'm love. I, I love it because I have the, I have I have the full control of my time, so I can work anywhere I want, anytime okay. I want. Control and, over time yeah. of your work. Okay. And aside from that, it's also paying good. <laughs> honestly. Okay. Any video, one video that made you famous, or it's long term? I feel like it's the consistency. Consistency, okay. Yeah, if you don't put out content consistently, then sometimes uh, it would die down. Okay. Yeah, so you'd have to like be patient and disciplined if you want to post once a week. Um, every other week, that's fine, as long as you do it consistently. Do you have any advice for people who want to do, or young people also who want to do like content creation, being on social media? What would you say? Maybe, maybe you first. Okay. So I can get more. <laughs> <laughs> um, what I always tell people, especially if I find out that they're starting out on social media, because it seems perfect when you look at everybody, like you know, their perfect life, all mm -hmm. the highlights. It's all fun and beauty right yeah. but what I tell them is if you want to do content creation you don't have to focus on the numbers you don't have to focus on like all the basically all the numbers because if you focus on the numbers then you lose track of the, the content the question is the advice right <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. like for young people oh. of, uh, an I think if they're really interested in doing social media you can give it a try I mean they'll never know if it's for them unless they try right but mm. the thing is because I used to think that 
doing social media is all just fun. It's it's all easy money and just just doing videos and you're you're gonna earn. But yeah. when I got into it, I realized that it's it's still work and it's a proper and, work. and work is supposed to be tiring. Work is tiring actually. Any kind of work is tiring. So <laughs> it's not it. four people staying at Crimson Hotel for five days. <laughs> oh, it's so tiring. <laughs> <laughs> oh, five star hotel. It's so tiring. Staying for free. <laughs> <laughs> no, this is this workation. So we're, we're doing work and vacation at the same time. <laughs> like people want to kill him right now. No. <laughs> but if I do skits, no. man, it's no. so tiring. If yeah. I do skits, so. we, we all content creators here. We know it's a lot of work. Yeah, so, yeah. Like, especially, especially behind the scenes. Yeah, I know. Especially if, if you're also a one-man team. So yeah. you do the acting, you all do the preparation yeah. and the editing and stuff. So production, but, yeah. but you yeah. can't deny that it's fun. It's, it's fun actually. Fun. I mean, it, I wouldn't go back to my. I, I, if I have a choice, I yeah. won't go back to my previous okay. job. I still choose this path. Your boss is watching. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. He's doing no, His they boss were, is doing TikTok. They were very supportive <laughs> of me actually when, yeah. I, when I resigned from my work. So. Everyone is curious about is how much money you make on, on TikTok and on social media. Okay, so how it works. First, um, if you talk about like YouTube, then you would have AdSense. Um, like money from ads. Yeah, like from money from ads and YouTube money from pay, views. Yeah. It's different thing. So, uh, but for me, the main income comes from when brands pay you to post for their products. Yeah. Okay. So like for example, you are already at this um, amount of followers, then you would have your own rate for a single post, for example. Okay. Like a single IG post, single construction, <laughs> single, single um, video, right? So okay. that's how it works. Yeah. So for yeah. me, that's also my so my okay. basically my source of income. Since I don't do YouTube that much, I'm I'm mostly yeah. focused on TikTok. And you you cannot earn on TikTok just based on views. Mm -hmm. Unlike in other countries, they have like a creator okay. fund where you basically earn from views. But in the Philippines, we don't have that. So yeah, yeah. Um, okay. creators usually just earn from from brands, from brands collaborations. Uh, and plus, Philippines is very different for earning money. We know because yeah. for AdSense, yeah. for sure, the money it's is like it's lower. Super yeah. Yeah. Super yeah. But yeah. So, so it's basically brands that are paying you the yeah. most, right? Yeah. So, so okay. guys, can you make a, a real living with with doing videos on, on you, TikTok? You definitely can. Yeah. yeah. But like. It has to be done in hard work first. Okay. You cannot get there okay. if you don't put a lot of hard work. So for me, before I even started earning like, for example, six digits, before I started earning six digits, I had like a year of no income. So guys, do you want to still be content creator in five years, for example? Well, if that's, the, if that's the question, if I want to, maybe I want to, but the question is if I can still do it in five years. Okay. Because social media is very unpredictable. You'll never know if you're gonna be re like true, relevant. What do you call that? Relevant <laughs> years after. Yeah, so, okay. so yeah. Because no more views, right? Yeah. Oh, it's, getting, it's getting low. Because oh, <laughs> same. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, but the, my view is like going up there and then going down and yeah, then going it's up a roller coaster. Yeah. Oh, so you'll yeah, never yeah. know. You cannot predict social media. Yeah. So for me, I see myself in the same field, but maybe not in front of the camera in the future. Okay. Maybe behind the camera, huh? but like in the same field. Same industry. Okay. Same industry. Yeah. Okay. Good. Let's do a skit now. <laughs> <laughs> or Let's, a do a Let's do a TikTok yeah. dance. Let's do a TikTok dance. Let's go. <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> Come on, John! Let's go, let's go! Ale, come on! I think guys he doesn't he doesn't want to, to join us. No, you don't have a choice. We're gonna take relax. Oh. Working yeah. shun, working shun. Come on! You don't want it? What's what's the skit about? No, it's not a skit. We're gonna do a TikTok dance. It's so easy. You can do it for sure. No, wait, but is it the truth now? Yes! Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We're gonna dance! Yeah. We're gonna dance, dance. right? We're gonna dancing, right? Yeah. What's the dance? Is it okay, uh, dance? Um, hold on. Yeah, the problem, I don't like TikTok. Sorry, yeah. guys. So, here's how we do our TikTok videos. Number one, you have to choose the sound. 
and make sure it's better if it's a trending sound. Yes, and then the next step is for you to dance and study the choreography. And then just shoot it. Let's go! Let's do it! Let's go! John was like, <laughs> What the fuck are we doing? It's a drunk man. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, energy. Okay, energy. Freestyle. Man, oh, oh, shit. <laughs> We often think that the job of content creator, or being a TikToker, is rather easy and simply fun. But as often, we only see the tip of the iceberg. And, you know, as content creator too, we know full well that the job is hard. That it requires much more work than what we think. And it needs a lot of sacrifice. Above all, probably a real resilience in the face of the inevitable failures, especially at the beginning. So we met Ben and Marvin, and finally we think that they are just two amazing down-to-earth people who have managed to make a living from it, and undoubtedly deserve their success. Hi vlog! Hi! Did you guys have fun? Yes! yes. 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 The energy is very high. Yes. <laughs> Do you want to go back to Manila? No! no. We want to stay here. Do you like Boracay? Yes! yes.